before that big shot. Oh! Well, that'll slow night. anyone down. Stopping Jordan in her tracks is Davenport. What up, y'all? This is your boy Ace here, and welcome to Afternoon's Delight. But let's get into it, y'all. Um, I'm going to start with this match because it was the first match of the night. And uh, for the woman's side, Blair Davenport faced Kalani Jordan, who had Dana Brooke ring side. And this, ba this match basically happened because, um, if y'all remember from the week before, Dana Brooke was talking to Kalani Jordan about finding the edge, going rogue, being more aggressive. And she told her to call somebody out. But they kind of... One thing that I know is about Kalani's character, and it's, and it's actually good because that's the role she's supposed to be playing. She's supposed to be playing this impressionable youngster, rookie, beginner who is very gullible and stuff like that, right? So she, her challenge is the most dangerous girl in a, a woman's locker room right now in Blair Davenport. You know what I mean? And we saw how she really shook Roxanne to her core and changed her, right? And gave her an edge. And uh, it was just hilarious how the opponent ended up being Blair Davenport. <laughs> I was like, damn, man, Dana Brooke, you, you kind of like skipped all these steps with Kalani, man. <laughs> You're going to have her coming at the Blair, right? But it was a good lesson for a good early lesson for it. So let's get into how the match went. So Jordan hit a uh, hurricanrana early on, but bounced back with a crossbody for a two count. Jordan reversed a hip toss into a backslide for a two count. Davenport turned the tables by tossing Jordan into a buckle and rolled face first. Jordan fought out with right hands and uh, had an axe handle rally. Jordan did a nice front flip into a back elbow for a near fall. Davenport escaped the overdrive attempt. De uh, Davenport hit Jordan with a draping front kick with a double stomp. And then Davenport hit uh, Jordan with a uh, Kamagai for the win. And that was all she wrote for Kalani Jordan in about three minutes and a half. Blair Davenport gets the win. And we're going to talk about in the next video where Dana Brooke took off her belt and started trying to whoop on uh, Blair Davenport. So let's see how the poll went. Um, I did a poll like right before the match. Like like I think it was like maybe 15 minutes before the match started, man. Uh, but y'all turned out pretty nicely for this. 30, 332 votes, 26 likes. Most of y'all chose Blair Davenport, 83% to 17%. No surprise there. But actually, here's the thing that I like. Kalani Jordan with the 17%, almost 20%. So a lot of y'all believe that she might win, you know? I guess a very tough Blair Davenport. But uh, I've been impressed with Kalani Jordan so far. I, I, obviously, she's a little green, but all, you know, all developmental wrestlers, this is why they're in NXT, right? So they can learn how to wrestle. I don't really look for them to be this or that. Because someone that's really come along lately is Tatum Paxley. Tatum Paxley kind of reminds me of Anna J and AEW. She's really come along lately. Like, and just early this year, she was green herself, man. So, like, and I think I think Kalani's a quick learner. And she reminds me a lot of Soul Ruka in that ring. You know, she could do all the flips because he's got the gymnastics background. Um, I think she's going to be pretty good, man. She's got so much potential, man. Um, and the reason why, look. The reason why she's been she's been fighting on the main television show a lot because they see the potential in her. Man, she's gonna be so good, man. But a uh, good win for Blair Davenport, man. We're gonna talk about this segment next with Dana Brooke. <laughs> we gotta get to that one, man. But go ahead and get this video a like, share, subscribe, y'all. Thank y'all for watching. After news to like.